Got the letter. What's going on? We inside a reality hour, real people, real life situations. What's good? All right, dear Sam. I'm a single father of three kids under 10. Their mother left the hospital three years ago, shortly after our youngest started walking. Last I heard, she was living in South America. After she left, I immediately requested, and after a long case, I got sole legal and physical custody. Now, the issue, my children's mom, great aunt, died and left her entire estate to me and my children. This aunt lost her only child in the Gulf War when he Mm. was 22. He had a daughter, but the mom wanted nothing to do with my family, so she kept her away. That is, until recently when she showed up at my job, I worked for her company that she started and owned, and now I own it since it's a part of her estate. Uh, She stated that she and her daughter and six grandchildren are the rightful heirs to the estate. I haven't heard of her until I contacted my children's grandparents, and they confirmed it was true. I asked her why she thought it why she thought she was entitled to anything I didn't tell her about the notarized will stating I was the sole heir she played the family card I asked her where she's been the last 30 years I knew my children's mom for 15 years and not once was she or her daughter mentioned in my presence she claimed to be shunned by everyone I also asked when did her mother-in-law die she couldn't even give an answer but for the record it was seven years ago and all my and all my children have some part of her name as their names. I want to know what to do about this woman. There was a court date that she set up and had me serve, but she didn't show up. I tried to file a restraining order, but no luck because she wasn't threatening me or my kids. That's that's the law in my area. You're good. Everything's fine. You're going to be straight. Mm -hmm. If they find, if they, if they, uh, if they went through and did a, uh, the, the whole the if they went through and they did uh, uh, what they call that they do the will. Yeah, he has a notarized will, so everything is really good um, on his part. Yeah. And when she filed the lawsuit contesting the the will for the estate, well, um, she didn't show up. Yeah, this this closed case. Yeah. Now, his attorney should have asked that since she didn't show up, that the that it be dismissed with prejudice so that she could Can't bring it up again. Yeah. yeah. So, I don't know. I, w- I would file something like that or, you know, maybe ask for a summary judgment or something like that, default yeah. judgment. Yeah, you, yeah, you, you, and you got that paperwork and it's nothing she can do. Yeah. No, if, if they, yeah, you got that will, they did all, they put all this stuff in the trust. Go handle your business, people. Because uh, folks would just pop up out of nowhere, mm-hmm. um, you'd be dead. But your family, your family, would, you know, have to deal with that. So. And it can break up families, all types. Of yeah, especially the wrong person get a hold to it. Yeah. You know, you got some. Uh, and make sure no papers in your couch, like Aretha. You know, they right? Found that they, they found they that other wheel and, paper, and it worked. They and it did. actually worked. It did work. It worked. Yeah. Don't find no balloon. Put it in your couch. Yeah. But keep showing up to court, yeah. make, making sure that everything is um, in order, and your your attorney should have some, some yeah. remedies for you. You'll be good on that. There's nothing real. I mean, we get the comment section. Pretty sure everyone's saying the same thing that, that we're saying. You don't have nothing to worry about with this. This is real easy and simple. Oh, for sure. Yeah, Adrian said, dude, if you have the notarized will, then you have no concern about her. That's the legally. That's as legally binding as it comes. And Steve said, do nothing. She already played her card when she tried to serve you papers. She doesn't have enough money to continue taking you to court. That's why she didn't show up. Now run me 10% of your inherit- inheritance for my legal advice. <laughs> <laughs> me too, man. We need to spend that money wisely. Come g- give me a call. <laughs> Send me your number. They ain't calling you. <laughs> <laughs> 